Hi everyone, uh, today I'm recording this video for those who are facing the same issue that I faced today uh, with uh, Tuxera. So uh, I tried to update, it showed here that I need to update uh, the application, but when I tried to update here, uh, it did not allow me actually, it gave me this message here. Uh, error while performing update input slash output error 5 so I looked online and I found the solution um, it's uh, not that hard uh, you just you need to be a bit uh, uh, technical maybe uh, just, just, just to solve it but uh, I have the solution here so no need to worry about it uh, all you have to do is just to go to the finder here and in the finder you go to application okay go to applications then you go to Tuxera disk manager you uh, with two fingers you tap on that to get this uh, menu here you click on show package contents after that you will get to the contents folder here you double click on that then you double click on the Mac uh, OS to open it then you get here so then you click to open it with terminal it will take you to this page actually uh, before this it showed me exactly what happened here but I recorded this video previously but when I reached the, to the stage where I have to restart I clicked on restart and the video was not recorded or was not saved so now I had to redo the whole thing so basically what's gonna happen here it will show you a message here that uh, the update or the process has been completed and successful so then that, that should be it, it was, uh, you will get another window with ask you for you know like term terms and condition you click continue uh, another continue maybe then it will show your activation code then you will get you would get to another stage where you have to restart your PC um, then you click restart and it should be it very simple and and based on that uh, you would be able to uh, see this mark here or this uh, icon has changed it will show you no update available if you think this video was uh, helpful and useful please click on the like and subscribe buttons also if you have any questions you may leave your comments below and thank you very much for watching see you in the next one